The burning bush. It's not just something encountered by Moses in the Bible. The garden guy says you can have fiery fall color in your yard, too. Michael Rook, the garden guy here. Color is not necessarily just meant for the spring. It doesn't mean that you're waiting for the flower itself. Remember, we live in northwest Ohio and southeast Michigan. Sure, plants like this, the viburnum, this is the Jedi, we got the Cayuga next to us. What they do is they bloom and they give a great fragrance in the springtime. Usually it's gonna be in between, say, around April 15 and Mother's Day. But they come out with clusters of beautiful coral-looking blossoms and the fragrance is just great competition for things like lilac. However, you got nothing but just a bland green throughout the, the rest of the summer, right? Well, when autumn comes, kaboom, these guys and gals just give off the most beautiful autumnal array of color that can't be beat. It's not just for the maple trees anymore. It's not just for the ash trees. It's not just for anything that's going to be bigger than you or I. It's these things. Now, do not do any type of trimming or pruning on these this season. Why, you ask? Because we've got flowers for next year, and these things set up the flowers for next year this fall. If you cut this, if you trim it, you're cutting away next year's blossom. So, if you want to hang on to color, it's autumn color right Right now, spring color around April. Don't cut them. For Fox Toledo, I'm Michael Ruck, the Garden Guy. Don't forget to watch me here, first of four, every Wednesday, right here on Fox Toledo. See you next week.